Hey, welcome to the Daily Brief for April 12, 2019. Alright, so yesterday was a heavy topic, so I'm going to do something a bit later today. Um, today at work, um, I got to watch Guardians of the Galaxy. Uh, I was hanging out with a guy, and he wanted to watch Guardians of the Galaxy, and I was like, yeah, that's fine. So we watched Guardians of the Galaxy. That's one of Marvel's better movies. Um, the first one. The second one I'm not a big fan of, but the, f the first one. Really good. And um, I'm going to talk a bit about... Um, it hit me in the feels. So, quick story. Before ECT, I used to occasionally tear up at movies. Um, Iron Giant, especially. And, you know, I, the tear would roll down my cheek. And um, and then I had ECT, and it opened me up, like, raw nerves. And I was crying at fabric software commercials. <laughs> um, so, now I don't do that anymore, thankfully. <sighs> Thank God, because, you know, Snuggle Bear. Just, but anyways, um... So I do cry easier though than I used to. And one of the things that hits me hard every time I've seen it, and I've seen Guardians of the Galaxy, I don't know, at least five or six, seven times. Um, Cause we've watched it at work a bunch of times. I saw it in theater twice. It was a good movie. Um, there's, so Groot is the big talking tree that says I am Groot and um, Two scenes in particular hit me every freaking time, and they hit me today. And so I'm just going to talk about the fact of how much they hit me. Um, and uh, yeah, so uh, if you don't know, Guardians of the Galaxy is about a, a superhero band of people in space, and uh, there's like like a uh, Amer American guy. Actually, he is American. Um, a guy from Earth, and there's a green lady from another planet and there's this purple guy from another planet and then there's this raccoon that is genetically altered and then there's this giant walking tree named Groot and yeah so just for the people who don't know because my father-in-law occasionally watches these so he's, he has no clue what we're talking about right now Groot only says three words he says I am Groot now Rocket understands everything he means so he'll say I am Groot to Rocket and he knows exactly what he means and he says, I am Groot again, and he knows he's talking about something different. I don't, we're not going to get into how. But so, throughout the whole movie, he just keeps on saying, I am Groot, and Rocket goes, what do you mean this? And he'll say, I am Groot, and like, Rocket would be like, but I don't want to do that, you know. And it's just this play off of the fact that he only says three things. And this is a spoiler, but at near the end um, of the thing, there's a ship crashing, and there's the five of them. And Groot literally, he can, he, he's a tree basically, but he can like make his limbs grow really fast and stuff. And he literally encompasses, makes himself into a big circle, into a big sphere of wood and s holds on to the people in the group and Rocket, who hasn't really shown ton, too much emotion or growth throughout the whole thing, all like you know, gets in his face, and this is his guy. This is who he's been with this whole time, and he's literally, like, "What are you doing? You're gonna die!" And Groot says, "We are Groot." Just saying it literally makes me tear up, and he just says, "We are Groot," and like, and it just looked like Rocket looks like just devastated, and then. And Groot dies. Now, Groot is brought back as a little twig because a little part of him can grow into another Groot, but it's not the exact same Groot that was there. So he literally sacrifices himself. Um, and yeah, it was just the we are Groot thing hits me every freaking time. It's because it's two CGI characters talking to each other and it freaking wrecks me. <laughs> and then right after that, after the big battle's done and everything's over, Rocket sits, sits down, um, and this other character, Drax, the purplish guy, who's mainly been antagonistic towards Rocket for this whole time, sits down next to him, and Rocket just sits there and holds one of Groot's twigs, and, and Drax sits down next to him and just puts his hand on his head. And it's just like, and, and immediately Rocket goes like this, and then looks at him, and then just like, goes back to grieving and they sit there and it's just they sit there and every time it makes me cry every time damn you guardians of the galaxy it's a stupid marvel film making me cry um but yeah we are group
That's all I got today. Thanks for watching. God bless.